Hey guys, Rick with CMIBeach.com. We're here tonight. This is Brittany's Gardenia Wonderland. Really cool black light event. This is a lot going on here. This is just an exciting evening. Look at the art right here. Look at the art and look at the art in the middle right here. This is the art that's amazing. Brittany, how are you doing tonight? I'm fantastic. Tell everybody what's going on. We are here doing a pop-up art event. We got glow art, we got food, we got a bunch of artists here. We're gonna have a movie playing over here in a second. It's gonna be great. This is awesome, man. What, what gave you the inspiration to do something like this, Brittany? Always wanted to do my own pop-up. Your own pop-up. Always wanted well, to Well, look, do it. thank you so much for letting me be part thank of it. Thank you for coming. CMyBeach.com is all excited because we love you know, capturing the positive thing. You're supporting other artists, which is awesome, okay? And other vendors and things in the community. And I just, you know, we hope you do well tonight. Thank you. And we're going to highlight it a little bit here and, you know, go around and check stuff out. All right. So we'll talk to you fun. later. Sounds Handshake good. of the 21st century, honey bunny. Woo! All right, we'll talk to you later right here. Right. You brought some pizzazz to us, what I'm talking about. All right, well, we'll talk to you later, Brittany. We're going to go around and check everything Have out. Fun. We'll talk to you later. Bye. Later, Gator. <laughs> and we got a puppy in the house. That's always good when we have a puppy in the house. Hey, sweetheart. How are you doing tonight? Great, right, thanks. Very good. She gonna bring that attitude on. Oh, you don't wanna do nothing with your life. What a fire! Here we are at Britney's Gardenia Wonderland. I'm with Lindsay. What's up, Lindsay? Hey, how's it going? Awesome, awesome. You're the donut girl, so tell me how that came to be. Yeah, so I bought Sandbar Donuts in uh, about September, so maybe four-ish months. But yeah, I took it over, kind of fell into my lap, so now I'm a business owner. Um, we are located up at 102840 Overseas Highway, and we're a food truck. So we sell made-to-order cake donuts and coffee, um, and we have 18 flavors on our menu, and we also have weekend specials and monthly specials. So if you're ever in the area, come check us out. We make the donuts. They're super fresh, super hot, and you guys will love them. All right, I'm going to have one in a couple of minutes off camera. Absolutely. Because yeah, it may be messy. I don't want to look really bad and everything like that. But I've heard uh, Wendy and uh, uh, Jane from Tropical Realty, the Wasman team, are the ones who told me about you. Wonderful. And says you're just a, a great person and uh, doing a great thing over here. So I wanted to highlight you while we were here, okay? Well, I really appreciate it. Everybody that. look Thank for you. Lindsay over here, Thank okay? You. Uh, absolutely. And what's your what's your website? Uh, uh, www.sandbardonuts.com. You can place orders online. You can check out our menu. We do catering and events, obviously. So check awesome. out. Awesome. And here's somebody else. What's your name? Hi, I'm Maggie. Hey, Maggie. How you doing tonight? I'm good. We'll get you on camera while we have you here. <laughs> so you're her assistant, I assume, huh? I am her assistant. Awesome. <laughs> I want to be Lindsay's assistant. That's awesome, man. <laughs> All right, Lindsay, the way we end our, our videos, our interviews for the since 2009 is the handshake of the 21st century. Awesome. The fist bump. And you Thank too, brother, bring it in. All right, right here in Tavernier, Florida. I guess this is Tavernier, huh? Yeah. Yep. All right. What's your name, man? How you doing, buddy? I'm David. How you doing, David? I'm doing oh, you well. just uh, you just uh, come and check out the event. No, I help her set up and everything. You help her set up? Yeah. Okay, cool, man. Well, she's got a good thing going here, man. Yeah. We were looking for you because we needed a taller person exactly. to get the lights on. Exactly. You, were, you left us hanging. All right, brother, you're gonna get here too. Take care. Nice talking to you, David. Nice Bye, everybody. Bye. We're not through yet. All right, here at Brittany's Wonderland, we got some people here with alcohol. So tell me what's going on. What's your name? I'm Erin. Hey, Erin. I'm Abby. Hey, Abby. How y'all doing tonight? Really you guys are like perky and in a good mood. You've been drinking? Yeah. No, no. no, it's okay to drink and work it. This is the keys. Yeah, you're right. You're right about that. Because you know, I never used to do that until I started working in the keys. Yeah. And now wherever I am, I have alcohol while I'm working. There we go. Yeah, y'all are a bad influence. Yeah. Or a good influence. I'm yeah, not sure one what. Of the two. Yeah. One of the two, yeah. exactly. So y'all having a great time tonight? Oh, yeah. Awesome, awesome. <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys for being on camera, and we'll see y'all soon here. Thanks. Brittany's Wonderland. This is the bartenders. When I get off camera, I'll be hooking up with you guys. Cause I like access to all that. Y'all take care, guys. See you later. Bye bye. You mind if I interrupt you, young man? Hey, how are you What's doing up, tonight? guy? How you doing tonight? Very good. 
Good, my name is Rick. I'm just checking out what's going on here. This is, I see you're working on a surfboard here. What's your name? Uh, I'm Keith. Hey Keith, how you doing? I'm Rick. Very good, nice to meet Excellent. you. Excellent, tell me a little bit about your art. All right, so I'm a uh, local artist here in Alamorada, and um, I've got a small art studio downtown Alamorada. I do a lot of sport fish art and um, a lot of mural work around town too. Where's your studio? Uh, the studio is next door to Florida Keys Brewing Co. Okay. Uh, and the art district, Broadway Arts and Cultural District. And I've had it for about four years now, going on five. Awesome. Uh, you have a website? I do. The website's uh, therumbrush.com. The rum rush? The rum brush. Rumbrush.com. Rum brush. Gotcha. We put alcohol within the realm of your thing. I always We're did always my, uh, on my paintbrush and my rum drink by accident. So all my paintings <laughs> are rum. Nice. It's fully inspired, okay? Well Keith man, I appreciate you getting on camera. Hopefully people will go check out your stuff. We're gonna end it like we always end our, vi our, our interviews, and that is the handshake of the 21st century. All right, brother, we'll see you later. All right, so now we're at a, you guys have a food truck, right? Yeah. This is Lindsay. How you doing, Lindsay? I'm good. I don't know this guy. What's your name? My name's Sal. Who? Sal. Sal? Yeah. Keep it simple, man. It's my name, just three letters, R I C. All right, so Lindsay, tell me about your uh, food truck and what um, you guys carry. We are located at Coco Plum Place, uh, mile marker 97, okay. on the ocean side. Um, we are fully vegan food truck. Um, we have quite an extensive menu over there. We're open Wednesday through Sunday, 9 to 3. Closed Mondays and Tuesdays. And um, we have an awesome outdoor eating area. We have um, a beautiful garden set So you're open there. tomorrow, right? Yes. Guess where I'm eating at tomorrow? I'm eating at Lindsay's. <laughs> I'm going to eat it with you tomorrow. Actually, uh, well, actually, may even put it at the, at the end of this video because I'm going to go by there because I want to support vegan places because yeah. I've been a lacto ovo vegetarian for 34 years. That's awesome. And it's amazing for people, their health and everything. So, what do you do over there, Sal? Uh, how, about, how about prep? <laughs> how about with the prep and everything? Cool, cool. Looks like nice, clean people. I like seeing that at restaurants and all. Awesome. So tell me a little bit more about why people might come to your place. And I'm going to give them another reason because I'm going to go there tomorrow. Um, so I've been cooking professionally for about 15 years now. Um, I am a French trained chef. Um, so I understand techniques and all that kind of stuff. I decided to move out of, you know, the regular sector of your typical kitchen cooking. Right. And to open up my own place that was something that was really good for the environment and for the people who live here. Yeah, I love to hear that. There's nothing here. Like yeah, what that. people don't realize is that you're supporting the environment when you don't eat meat. Yes. And there's a, like a million reasons. Eating meat, sorry, but it's just stupid. There is just zero valid reasons for it. Especially when I quit eating meat, it was in New Orleans all those years ago, 34 years ago. And New Orleans fortunately had vegan only places. But when we left New Orleans, it was hard to find food in those days. Now, there's no excuse. You have fantastic yeah. vegan options, and uh, everyone should go vegan. If they did, the world would be a better place. Uh, and guess what? Let me tell you, He-Man, you can still be a He-Man and eat something that didn't die, okay? <laughs> a lot of these guys, man, they feel like they gotta be a man to eat meat. If you don't eat, they go, ho, 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 you know? You know, I'm a, I'm a regular guy, man. I ain't gotta eat something right. Nothing has to die to make me feel like a man. So hopefully, we'll get a lot more people going. We're vegetarian. gonna end this the way we end every interview. And that is with the handshake of the 21st century. What bam? What bam? Right. Oh, 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 oh! We we did it like that. That, <laughs> that was a stereotypical two white guys trying to be cool. All right, here you go. There you go, man. And one more for you. Here, right, Florida, you. amazing place. Got jugglers over here. We got we got my girl Lindsay over here. How you going? I just interviewed another Lindsay. Yeah. It's like Lindsay's in the house. It's like a food truck thing. Y'all all got all food truck people named Lindsay now. Yep, that's good. That's good. <laughs> That's a good name. All right, take care. All right, don't drop anything. I'm recording, guys. We put them under pressure. Why'd you have to say that? <laughs> I, I got you under pressure now, man. Good job, guys. Nice. Right here at Britney's Gardenia Wonderland. What's your name, young lady? My name is 
kiss Andrew. <laughs> hey, Kit, how you doing tonight? I'm pretty good. Um, I'm here at Brit's Gardenia Wonderland Black Light Party with my artwork. Awesome. You got some great stuff here. I was just looking a little bit before we started talking. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Tell me a little quickly about what your artwork is and you know your mission in life and that kind of stuff. Awesome. So, um, my shop is called Jellyfish Daydreams and my artwork is displayed there and the purpose of Jellyfish Daydreams is to bring awareness to marine conservation and uh, protecting our coral reefs. That's awesome. Yes. I love that when people do art and they give, they have giving back as part of it. That's super important, okay? Yes. All right, so tell everybody kind of what type of art you do. I know, so, I know it has to do with jellyfish. Yes. So my, most of my work is super kind of psychedelic and surreal. Right. Um, these paintings right here are uh, resin pores and they're black light affected. As well, I do uh, oil paintings that are kind of realistic but kind of surreal. So they're a little weird looking. Yeah, weird looking is good. Do you have a website? Yes, uh, my website is www.jellyfishdaydreams.com. Okay. And um, we are located in Tavernier. Okay. Uh, at 91865 Overseas Highway, and we are open Tuesday through Saturday, 12 to 6. We normally don't talk about people that aren't sponsors, but she's inside of the, tell me the name of it, it's the hotel. Uh, uh, Tavernier Hotel? Tavernier Hotel, yes. Yeah. Which I thought was closed, but guess what? There's a real good reason to go there because yeah. she is here. Yes, absolutely. She is here. Awesome. Well, thanks for being part of what we do. I'm going to get a little uh, camera on your uh, stuff over here real quick, and we'll talk to you later, okay? Awesome, Keep yeah. giving back to the community, okay? I just wanted to say one more thing. Please. Is that I donate 10% of all of my artwork and jewelry sales uh, directly to Eye Care, which is an Isla Mirada conservation, uh, coral reef conservation group. That's awesome. Well, you're yes. fantastic. Super nice meeting you. Thank you. And we're going to end the, the, the interview the way we have in every interview since 2009 that is with a fist bump which is the handshake of the 21st century all right oh and you brought some pizzazz with it look up that all right she don't just she don't just fist bump she brings it thank you Cassandra we'll talk to you later okay right here at Brittany's place this is awesome man this is just a good night really cool psychedelic artwork I'm old so I'm from the psychedelic era so I dig all that stuff yeah all right well nice talking to you we'll see you next time okay thank you. all right take care we're gonna go around and check out some other people and see what's going on here Oh yeah? Awesome. Oh my goodness. You like the nibble of your fingers. Yeah. You're just a precious baby. Yes you are. What's your Instagram so I can put it on there? Mm. Alright, we got some action happening right here at Brittany's Gardenia Wonderland. This guy's taking it seriously, man. Bring it. <laughs> Oh, this is good, man. What's your name? My name is Nathaniel Moore. I'm a member of the Jester's Guild on Key West. Nice. Awesome, brother. Thank you so much, okay? Yes, sir. Take it easy. Thank you. Who's this over here? Man who needs a shirt. What's up, man? <laughs> oh, man, look, look. I'll give you five bucks, I'll edit that out. <laughs> What's your name? Isaac. Isaac, how you doing tonight, man? All right. Give me a whole one of those for you, man. <laughs> I was messing with you. Very nice. Thank you, brother. What's up, brother? How you doing tonight? Fantastic, man. Great evening. Having a good Fantastic night? Fantastic weather. Oh, man. That was great. Perfect night. weather. Perfect yeah. weather. Absolutely. 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 Huh? Thanks for keeping the party going, my yeah. brother. We'll see you next time. All right. All right. Love to you.
We love everybody, man. We need some dancing in the house. All right, we got it right here. The bartender slash entertainment. We are entertaining. <laughs> I don't know if in a good way or a bad way, but you're entertaining, right? All right. Are y'all having a good night? Great night. We're getting It's really getting a lot busier, a lot more fun. Awesome. All right, well, thank you guys. See ya. No more dancing? You letting the brother down. <laughs> I'm used to disappointments in my old life. Talk to y'all. Checking out some stuff here. This is from Maria. How are you doing, Maria? I'm doing well tonight. Awesome. To be here. Well, Maria, tell me about your art. So my art. Well, hold on. We got to talk about your glasses first. <laughs> All right, those are kind of crazy. I like those, man, with I the know. little dangly things. A little fun. Uh, I like stuff. a little bling, a little stuff that dangles. That's all good. And I'm a regular guy, but we can like that too. Anyway, so tell me a little bit about your stuff. So I am a marine scientist. Okay, a marine scientist. Job. You look yes. stereotypical marine scientist. That's exactly what I would think they all look yes, like. Yes, in blue. In blue, yeah. Appropriate. Absolutely. Yes. Okay. So my art is really inspired by the ocean. Lots of blues, lots of ocean creatures. But I also do love my space. So I have a lot of stars, the moon inspiration. So actually my art account is called Luna in Blue. Okay, nice. And I do have an Instagram account at Luna in Blue. So you're welcome to check Luna out. Luna in Blue name. on Instagram? Yeah. We'll check it out. Do you do Facebook or any of that kind of thing? Nope, I hate Facebook, that. so it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So art is a hobby of mine, but I take inspiration from the ocean and what I do full time. Gotcha. Well, we, we're way into the ocean as well. We have HelpEndAllLitter.org, which is a nonprofit to teach kids, school age kids, to start cleaning litter as oh. you know, as children and all that. So it's so important, exactly. We just spoke the other day at a Treasure Village Montessori, as a matter of fact. Oh, we, we get those students that come to where I work and we teach them as well. So oh, okay. I am a teacher about marine science. Yeah, awesome. Well, we interviewed uh, Cher Framsey over there. Some of our oh, okay. heel kids interviewed him um, on his commitment to the environment. He's really good with that. He really, really protects the environment here and everything. Well, everybody check out her art and uh, go to Instagram to find it. And uh, thank you for being part of our, our uh, video tonight. Thanks. And we're going to end this the way we end every interview since 2009. The handshake of the 21st century. The fist bump. What's up? You didn't give me any like pizzazz. Oh, I'm sorry. All right, let's do it again. All right, there we go. Gotta, gotta blow it up. All right, thank you so much for being part of this, Maria. And we'll talk to you later right here at Britney's Wonderland. This is awesome, isn't it? It really is. This is like what a is super fun thing? night. She's supporting other artists. Yeah. I think it's a great thing. It is such a cool thing to be a part of. Absolutely. She manipulated me to be here. I had other plans. She, she can be forceful, you know that, right? Yeah, same. I had completely <laughs> other things to do, and all of a sudden, you know, well, you're just going to have to change those plans, because I got yeah. something going on. Anyway, Brittany's awesome. Thank you so much, Maria. We'll talk to you later. Thank you. Check out her stuff right here, and we will talk to you later. I wish you had more of us. <laughs> yeah, we need more people dancing, man. Yeah. Well, you guys are rocking it. Thank you. What's your name? Travis. Travis, how about you? Elena. Elena, how are y'all doing tonight? Doing good. This is the coolest place to be, huh? It sure is. It's absolutely gorgeous out here. Y'all from the area? Marathon. Marathon. You foreigners. Yeah. <laughs> You're still in the keys, though. Yeah. You from Marathon also? Uh, yeah. Awesome. This is Brittany's Den here with all her artwork, and I found you guys in here. What's going on? Hello, Glenn. What's your name again? Keith? Keith. Yeah, Check man. it out, man. Absolutely. So, you doing body painting? Doing a little body painting. Whose body are we painting? What's your name? Courtney. Courtney, how you doing tonight? How are you? You having fun? I am. Pretty cool event, isn't it? Awesome. I love all the black light stuff. Oh, yeah. I'm old, so this is from my era, man. All the psychedelic stuff and all. 
<laughs> you didn't have to agree with me being old, Keith. Brittany's got one too. Uh, Maria got a big Brittany one. has one? Oh yeah. Good okay. Let me, see, let me see this too. again. How's the look on the camera? Oh yeah. That's Very good. nice. You get one way from the light. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Intense right there. Look at that. I'm going to get a picture of that. Okay. Pretty intense. Well, thank you for being part of our video, Courtney. Are you from this area? I am. What are you? Born and raised. Born and raised. Born and raised. All right, guys. So you never lived in any sucky areas? No. Oh no. There's a place called Alabama. There's Mississippi. Oh yeah. It could be worse, right? Yep. <laughs> All right. Right here in the Florida Keys. And Keith lives here, right? That's right. You love it here, don't you? About seven years now. We were talking about this off camera before, man. This is just a great area to be in. No place else. I'd no place else like it. For sure. Thank you for being on camera, Keith, <laughs> yeah, and thank yeah, you for, for, for painting girls' bodies, Keith. Well, you know, someone, You're a giver, man. Someone's got to do it. Someone's got to do it. And, you know, someone's got to film it as well. That's right. <laughs> All right. Exactly. You guys take care. Talk to you later right here at Brittany's Gardenia Wonderland. Got my girl Brittany on here with some body paint. My brother gets around. Keith, you get around, man. Respect. So, what do you think about tonight, Wynn? It's a great night, isn't it? Everybody's having a wonderful time. Absolutely. You're a great host. See why I gave up my time to come do this? I'm happy you're here. I'm glad you're having fun. It really is a great night, yeah. I, I really get into when the community comes together and uh, the artists are getting to express themselves and some of the people who have like food trucks and things. Those people have a lot of trouble getting their word out. So you're helping them do that tonight. Absolutely. That's the love, baby. And look, Brittany brought it. Love it, love it. I'm gonna go around and get a little more stuff before I leave. All right, take care. All right, we're about to close this out. I'm here with Brittany. How are you doing, Brittany? I'm good, thank Brittany, you. Brittany, Brittany, this has been like a, almost like kind of a, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use the word magical event because the people have really had a good time. It's been like coming together of a bunch of different people at the same time. And you put it all together. So tell me what's up with that. Yeah, it's just an amazing opportunity to actually put this all together and get these amazing artists and get these amazing food vendors that are here. Yeah. And just doing something a little different for the community and bringing it in and making it fun and bright and different. Well, I think it's been amazing and and the, the light is not really good right here but trust me this is amazingly beautiful right here Br <laughs> Brittany is like an all-around person to where uh, when I met you uh, you work at the Good Health Clinic yes. and uh, which means you're giving to other people and uh, you know you're just a beautiful person inside and out yeah. care about the community and this is a this is a significant showing of that yeah. and I think a lot of people got a lot of notice that they were looking for and you know I think that's really important. Thank you. Yeah, I hope they did. I'm hoping everyone had fun. I know I had fun with everybody so it was great. So we're gonna end this the way we end every interview. All right. You probably know all about that, right? The handshake of the 21st century, the fist bump. Woo! Woo! And I knew I would get some pizzazz from Brittany. <laughs> all right, Brittany, we're gonna get out of here and uh, I think we've we've highlighted a lot of people here that are just like really up and coming people. Yeah. And uh, you know I appreciate you doing that and being part of what we do. And I will talk to you soon. We're doing some videos at your place coming Thursday. Yes, we are. Absolutely. All through the community support side of SeeMyBeach.com because we love the community. It's what we do. And uh, I give up myself because uh, you know I'm not good at anything else. So <laughs> I come out and try to do positive things in the community and and uh, you know be positive, right? Yeah. That's what else can you do and, and be, yeah. feel good about yourself. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank Love you. you, Brittany. You did a great job tonight and just in general. And I'll see you next time. Right. Take care, everybody. Strange guy in the background here. How you doing, my friend? How are you? <laughs> are you a strange guy or just a guy? I'm a strange guy, yeah. How you doing tonight, man? What's your name? I'm John. John, nice to meet you. I'm Rick, man. Nice to meet you. That's Brittany. I know. Hi, Brittany. What's up? You know Brittany? I do know Brittany. So, yeah, he actually handles some of our patients from Good Health Clinic. Awesome. Yeah. You do what now? So he's a doctor that helps Well, with I love you, man. Thank you for giving back. What's your name? I'm John. John. Nice to meet you. John, what's your last name, John? Tora Grossa. Who? Tora Grossa. Who? Tora Grossa. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We'll have to superimpose that, man. Yeah. All right, man. Well, you, so you work with the Good Health Clinic, huh? I am. Yeah, I volunteer. We're, do, we're doing videos over there on Thursday. Okay. And the point is that it's about people like you who are giving back to the community. So we're, I'm glad I got to meet you tonight. Thank you. Man. Yeah, because we need people like you because the people who are going to the clinic, I mean, they work in places here. They're just people who need help. 
without a doubt. I mean, I've been involved since it opened. Uh, really? How many years ago? Because, because of that very reason. I mean, there's a local population that needs assistance, and um, if you're able to, then why not? You know? Exactly. Well, you know, not everybody feels that way, so I appreciate that you do, John. Yeah, uh, it's unfortunate. They should. You know? it, well, it is very. The saying is, if your neighbor's house is on fire and you have a hose, you give it to them. Yes. Because you're the one with the hose. Yeah. And so many people will take the hose and run. Yeah. Because, like, you know, that's just how the world is. So thank you, John, for what you're doing. I'm Rick with SeeMyBeach.com. Handshake of the 21st century. Love you, man. Thank you for what you do, okay? Keep doing it. And, and when you do it, it inspires other people to do it as well. All right, my friend. We'll talk to you later, okay? Take care. We're going to close out tonight. This is right here in Tavernier, Isla Mirada, Florida. A beautiful night. Everybody had a great time. And uh, we're really excited about... Uh, our relationships here in the Florida Keys, and we will talk to you later from cmybeach.com.